I'm super excited to show you guys this for the channel. It's a Crave Kit snack box. Now, they don't do these regularly, but if you are a regular customer, so you've already got a subscription with them for the monthly Crave Kit, they do offer you a Crave Kit snack box. And I think they probably do it every like two or three months. It's not, you know, it's not that often. But the first box I had, I didn't actually open because I bought it as a present for my boss when he left. And then this is the second time I bought a box. So I bought it last month. So this month's May, so I bought it in April. And I'm super excited to see what snacks they've got in there because they do really fill them out. So you get really good value for money. So let's have a look. Okay, so this is my box. It's so obviously Crave Kit. They put the sticker on. I've just obviously ripped off my address and things. Um, it's a nice size box in terms of like thickness and stuff. I can just can feel there's things in there. I'm just so excited to dive in. So let's have a look at what they've given me. Ooh. Okay, yeah, so they are doing a food festival in London. I'm not gonna go to that one. I went to the Bristol one. Uh, it's just quite far for me with my baby and everything. And I'm really busy with work this month with people being off, so I'm covering a lot of people. So I really can't go to this. But if you're gonna go, then let me know if you're gonna go and who you're excited to see. I really enjoyed it in Bristol. There's so many great companies and reasons for why they're doing it. It's a good day out. Okay, so I see tons of great things in here. So first of all, Monarchs. I love this cheese. It's one of my favorite cheeses. They just make such an amazing product. It is like having the burnt bit of cheese you have on the pan. It's just got so much flavor. So this is super good. Gracie's got to get in the shot. Of course, my cats have got to get in the video somehow. This one, I've recently just done a video on Eva Bold and they normally have the crackers in here. So it's really nice to see these crackers. They're just so nice to have as an alternative, like when you fancy crisps, but like when you want something crunchy and to have like a cracker. Um, this was in the Crave Kit before. Was it in the Crave Kit? It was definitely in my bag I had from the Keto Festival. But they basically check ketones and it, you like scan it into an app or something and it tells you thing ketosis. So that's really cool to have. If you're someone that regularly tests, I personally don't, but it's just, it's a good idea. Okay, then we have some peanut butter. I think this is just normal peanut, not like a cashew or anything. Um, smooth peanut butter, pocket fuel. Yeah, I think this is just the normal peanut one because obviously you can get almond butter and all sorts of butters so i've had this brand before they're actually really nice and i just love that these are in little shots so i can just take them on and go then we have i spotted this one straight away hunter and gather they make such amazing sauces i did buy some from the festival so i've still got my ketchup in the in the cupboard and the barbecue sauce because i just love barbecue sauce so it's nice to have a little pot to have with dinner then we have, oh, let's get this one first. This was super nice. I really love this chocolate brand. And I just love that they have them in little bars when you open it. And I have had the chocolate one before. This was so nice. I normally have bits of chocolate before bed. I know you shouldn't really have things before bed, but when you're breastfeeding, you get like super hungry and you just have to snack. And this is one of those things that I just love, love, love. So all around, I love this product, it's really good. I'm super happy it's in the box. Then we have a fat cookie. I really, really enjoyed this. I didn't think I would just because of the ginger, but it, you know, it tastes just like a ginger biscuit, a ginger nut biscuit that we have in the UK. So I really, really did enjoy this. I probably enjoy this just as much as the normal almond vanilla cookie that they do. And it's just all around it. Again, fat just do amazing products too. It's so, so delicious. Then we have Seriously Low Carb. I think these are the truffles. Oh, yes, they are. Do you know, guys, I really enjoyed these. I had these from the festival because Seriously Low Carb bake all those breads. But these truffles are really nice. I took them to work because it's nice just to have like a quick bite of something sweet. And, you know, these really just hit the spot. Both of them, I would, I would eat both of them. They're both just as nice as each other. Gracie's got to get in the box. She's like, what about me? 
Um, then we have Keto Baker. I actually had their mug cake the other day. I don't know what one this one is. I think they're going to be saying on the back. Oh, this is literally the one I had yesterday. It was really nice. Really filling too. I had it with some sugar-free fudge sauce. Really nice. And super easy to make too. So I really, really am glad this is in here as well because it's so convenient when I'm working from home and obviously I'm looking after Imogen too. Then we have these ones. I've had these before. So this is by the No Sugar Company. They make really nice little chocolates. So this is probably going to be like an after eight. I don't think I tried the mint one before though, saying that. But I do like mint chocolate, so I'm going to enjoy this. This is going to be nice. And there's another one in there. So they've got, I think this is peanut butter, is it? Yeah, it's the peanut butter. Ah, oh, this one was nice too. I'm glad this one's in here. I didn't think much of the just chocolate one because I felt like there were other nicer, just straight up dark chocolates out there. But that was just me personally. Then we have, what's this one? Chocolate flavour almond brownie. Keto Pro. I don't think I tried this one before. But I'd be excited to try it. Keto Pro, we're at the Keto Festival as well. So it'd be nice to try this one. And yeah, I like a brownie. I don't know anyone who doesn't like brownies. So that'd be super nice. Then this is the last one in the snack box. Cacao Boost. Organic cacao, making my hemp and matcha powder. So this is just like a tea then I assume. Oh no, add to smoothies, breakfast, home bit. Oh, so you just add it. It's like having electrolytes, you just sort of add it. And it's got a multi caramel taste. Ooh, that sounds really nice. And obviously it's one serving per pack. I've never had this before, but I will definitely try it. I do like the idea of stirring it into porridge though, if it's going to be like a nice multi caramel. That might be nice with berries and things. So yeah, that's really cool. There's quite a lot of stuff here. So you can see all the products in the snack box is really good. It's a great price. <laughs> you okay? Should we send you back to Crave Kit? <laughs> yeah, so there you go, guys. So that was the Crave Kit unboxing for the snack box. Tell me what you thought about this. Um, if you've tried it before, if you're gonna try it. Obviously, I think you only get to buy them if you already subscribe to the Crave Kit. So you need to do that first before you are basically told about the snack box when they become available. But there's a lot of great products in there. I can't remember what the price was off the top of my head, but it's obviously a lot cheaper than just buying a one-off box. I think the boxes are normally like £30 for the Crave Kit subscription. For the snack boxes, I think they're around, I think I'm pretty certain they were £10. So for all these snack products, that's really good for the money, for value. And that's what I love about Crave Kit. They've just, over the, over the years of them running, they've just gotten like, they've just gotten better and better. And they're just like giving out all these great products and really expanding themselves. And I just think it's, it's just a great company. I just, I would buy from them. I would, I recommend them. So I'm gonna end the video here on the snack box. And just let me know guys what you thought of it and if you want to see anything else on the channel that's similar i love doing unboxings especially when it's you know like snacky things i love to snack especially with um breastfeeding it just makes me super hungry so yeah i'm gonna end it here